Happy Friday, everybody. I hope you're all well. I just want to touch base with a couple of things for the next week or so. Uh, first, next week, as we all know, is Thanksgiving. Eileen will be out of the office Wednesday, Thursday, Friday. As of now, I will be out Wednesday, Thursday, Friday. So please, if you need anything for open houses, listings, whatever, please let us know ASAP. Also, next Monday and Tuesday, I'll just have a little something for everyone to come and pick up. So if you'd like to stop by, I will let you know via text where I will leave it in case you don't want to come in the office. I may just leave these little packages by the back door on the table, but I will text you and let you know. Okay. That being said, uh, something important we need to uh, discuss and you must be aware of. Uh, NAR has changed or added um, an article to Article 10 of the Code of Ethics. Okay, as we all know, the Code of Ethics Article 10 um, prohibits realtors from discriminating on the basis of race, color, religion, sex, handicap, uh, familiar status, national origin, sexual orientation, or gender, gen, excuse me, gender identity um, in the provision of professional services and in employment. They have now added to this, so it is now Article 10-5. Realtors must not use harassing speech, hate speech, epithets, or slurs against any member of those protected classes. What that means is verbally or in social media instances, you cannot bash or slur any one of these classes. If so, and someone complains or they feel that they've been done wrong or attacked, you will be held accountable, okay, by NAR. So I just wanna make sure everybody understands that. Also, one other thing, and we don't have finalization on it yet, but NAR has been uh, working with the uh, DOJ, the Department of Justice, on what a buyer's agent gets paid uh, at closing or your commission split, whether it's a 2% or 3%. Uh, there seems to be some issues throughout the country. I don't know about here, uh, but they are working on coming to an agreement. So it is possible that shortly your commission on the buying side will be public. I'm not sure where that falls. I don't know uh, exactly how it's going to work, um, but as soon as we have all the information, I will let you know, but it's just to kind of give you a heads up on it. All that being said, I will speak to you again before Thanksgiving. But meanwhile, please, everybody be safe. Everybody knows the numbers are up. Please just take those extra precautions. If you are doing open houses, if your seller is allowing you to do them and you want to do them, please make sure you are still following our rules. One person in the house at a time, everybody must sign in. Don't touch doors, handles, anything. So please, please go back to that right now. Um, we don't want to, you know, uh, worry about your health and the client's health, the homeowner's health. So please, everybody be careful. I would think probably this weekend and next weekend, not many of you will be doing open houses. Um, and if you don't want to do them and your homeowner wants you to, then maybe find someone who it doesn't bother. But please, I want all protocols followed. All that being said, thank you. Have a wonderful weekend. Enjoy this beautiful weather and we'll talk next week. Thank you. Bye.